Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and it's 11.09 a.m., and it's Wednesday, April 20th, 2022. So, ah, yeah, boys, ah, yeah, ah, yeah, ah, yeah, ah, yeah, today's 4.20, so ah, yeah, ah, yeah, ah, yeah. Good day for my brother, you know, just saying, but I'm anyway. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing another one of these Splash Fizz sparkling waters I got at the new Casey's General Store gas station at Malgi. I was like around $1.75, I think, around $2, see what I mean? So I guess it's okay priced, but um, anyway... Um, this one sounds like it might be pretty good. We shall see. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Raspberry and Blackberry Splash Fizz, like sparkling water drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that bottle. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, it has a gold top lid. You can see the color, it's like a dark red, see what I mean? It says raspberry and blackberry flavor, splash fizz, and it shows the raspberries and the blackberries. Zero sugar electrolytes, and it has like angel wings on the zero. Raspberry, blackberry flavored sparkling beverage with other natural flavors, 24 ounces, 591 milliliters. It shows like a lot of bubbles on the background pattern, it looks pretty cool. You know, just saying, very colorful logo. Reminds me of like graffiti or something, or like doodles, with like the, you know, the bubble letters. And the fizz actually is bubble letters, because yeah, it's bubbles, you know, just saying, because yeah, it's fizz. Definitely carbonated, you know, just saying. Um, so yeah, it has the same thing on this side. Then it has some recycling stuff, empty and replace cap plastic bottle, and it has a recycling logo. It has SKU and some other recycling stuff. It contains no juice. Nutrition facts, says one bottle, 591 milliliters, amount per serving calories, 10. Total fat, 0 grams, 0 percent. Sodium, 15 milligrams, 1 percent. Dark carbohydrate, 0 grams, 0 percent. Protein, 0 grams. Magnesium, 20 milligrams, 4 percent. Zinc, 0 0.5 milligrams, 4 percent. The other ingredients, purified water, carbon dioxide, less than 0 0.5 percent of natural flavor, citric acid to preserve freshness. Magnesium sulfate, potassium sorbate to preserve freshness. Sucralose, potassium benzoate to preserve freshness. Red 40, calcium disodium EDTA, and zinc sulfate. Blue Triton Brands Incorporated, Stanford, Connecticut, 06902. Copyright 2021. Visit SplashFizz.com. Phone numbers 1-844-577-5274. All trademarks are owned by Blue Triton Brands Incorporated or used under license. Caution contents under pressure open slowly away from face. So yeah, if you've seen my review from yesterday, um, definitely know it's definitely very fizzy, like how the name says, you know. It's definitely really carbonated, like really, really, really. Um, see what I mean? But, um, yeah, I'll let you see the logo right quick. Cool looking logo, very colorful, you know, just saying with all the berries and stuff. I like the colors on and stuff, see what I mean? Same thing on this side. And this side is the nutrition fact side. And one side's a little bit messed up where the label like connects, you know. But I'll show it up close in a minute too. But um this week I was being filmed for a documentary. So I'm on the camera guys, you could see him a little bit in my video from yesterday on the second half of the review, you know. Um so I have to tell him next time we film. So um you know, he won't be in the frame of my video, you know, just saying. I might have him, like, stand outside my car and film me inside, you know, see what I mean? Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm going to show off the bottle up close right quick, so hold on a minute. Here's the raspberry and blackberry splash fizz, like water. It shows the blackberries and the raspberries, and it has, like, a lot of bubbles and stuff. Cool looking label, you know. Has electrolytes and stuff. Here's the nutrition back side. Hopefully, you'll be able to see the label a little bit better. SKU and stuff. Okay, that's pretty much the entire bottle. So, anyway, I'm gonna finish my review for it right quick. So hold on a minute. Okay, I showed off the bottle up close. I'm gonna shake it up a team bit, you know, because I'm a renegade, but yeah, I actually probably don't want to be shaking this, you know, just saying. But I mean, right now I'm about to open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So, hold on a minute. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. 
started bubbling up at the top. You can see all the bubbles and stuff. Um, so yeah. Gonna... Inside the lid is like nothing. But yes, definitely starting to bubble up. Definitely fizzy, you know, like how it says. This one isn't like exploding out at the top like the one I had yesterday did. The one yesterday um, got on my tablet and got on my glasses a little bit, but um, this one isn't doing that yet. Still a little bubbly though, see what I mean? Um, but yeah, the smell. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely a very sweet um, berry scent. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely smell the blackberry. Um, reminds me a little bit of the discontinued Mad Dog Punch Monster Energy Drink. A little bit like that. Um, sort of like a grape, but not really a grape. Definitely more of a darker type of berry. Yeah, it's definitely blackberry. Um, I can smell the raspberry maybe a teeny bit, but I think it's mostly blackberry. Um, yeah, definitely smell the blackberry more than the raspberry. The raspberry um, reminds me a little bit of like the um, raspberry like Kool-Aid jammers, you know? It's like that, you know? Still a sweet raspberry scent, but not too pungent, though, see what I mean? Um, but yeah, it smells pretty good, though, but yeah, I mostly smell the blackberry, though, see what I mean? I mean, we're now going to try it, so here goes. <clears throat> I just got some on my wheel. So, oh yeah, boys, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely strong carbonation. Mm -hmm. Definitely feel it when it goes down your throat. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Got a little bit of chest pain. When I have like very um, high carbonated drinks, I don't know why, but my chest starts hurting for a little bit. Because that one time when I drank like a Pepsi, my chest started hurting. Like right after I drink it. I think it's because of the carbonation and the fizz, you know. Very strong carbonation. So yeah, you don't, probably not going to be able to chug this, you know, just saying. Um, cause yeah, it's definitely very carbonated. Um, definitely a very strong flavor. A bit sweet though. Yeah, I think it's mostly blackberry. Um, can't really taste the raspberry too much. Maybe a teeny bit. Probably say like 80 to 90% blackberry. Maybe like 20 to 10%, um, you know, raspberry. But, um, when the flavor was mixed though, um, Definitely makes it more like a wild berry type of flavor. Yeah, definitely reminds me of like the wild berry pop tart. See what I mean? It's a little tart. Maybe a teeny bit bitter, but um definitely a very strong berry flavor, see what I mean? Um but yeah, it's I'm mostly blackberry though, but um still it's really good though, see what I mean? Definitely try this if you can find it. It's brand new. Got it at the new Casey's General Store gas station note Moggy. It's like, okay price is like right around $2 or so. So yeah, definitely try it if you can find it. It's actually pretty good. Um, but yeah, it's mostly blackberry flavored to me anyway. But um, definitely reminds me of like the discontinued Mad Dog, you know, Punch Monster. Reminds me of that. And also, maybe if you got that and mixed it with like the Raspberry Kool-Aid Jammers. Um, that's what this would be like. See what I mean? But yeah, it's definitely like a sparkling water. Definitely highly carbonated. See what I mean? <laughs> I'm definitely fizzy, like how it says, you know what I mean? So yeah, definitely try this if you can find it. Um, I think I like it about the same as the blood orange one, but I think I might like the blood orange one a little bit more. This one's still definitely really good, though. Um, I don't know why, but like, so far, both these flavors that I reviewed have actually been a little bit tart. Um, maybe if it was a little bit less tart, it'd actually be a little bit um, better, you know, just saying. And maybe if it wasn't as, you know, carbonated, you know? Um, cause yeah, I think it's a little bit too carbonated, you know, especially when I'm trying to drink it, you know, I start getting the chest pain, you know, see what I mean? Um, but yeah, still definitely try it. I'm gonna give the raspberry and blackberry splash fizz, like sparkling water drink. I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. Oh yeah, has a cool label design, it tastes good. It's okay priced, um, has a cool design. 
the flavor is pretty good, but um, yeah, it's maybe a little bit too carbonated and a little bit tart, but um, still think it's still pretty good though. So yeah, I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm gonna give it a nine out of 10. Anyway, my next review, I'm gonna be reviewing another flavors of this. I think it's the lemonade flavored one. So tuned for that review. So tuned for that review, some more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out and bye.